Hey everyone, welcome back to another Godot tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to spawn enemies outside the camera. Now previously in my other games I had problems doing this, and when I did try to fix it, it all failed, so I just eventually did nothing about it. So in this tutorial I'll show you a very simple way to do it, and it uses a Path 2D node to spawn them outside the camera. Now essentially, if we go into the Path 2D Follow node, we can change the offset property. If you look at this dot here, this is where the path follow 2D is, and we can just spawn the enemy randomly around this path. In the path 2D node, we can just create a box around here using the options up here. So this is just a basic top-down movement. Very simple, I just have the tank following my mouth. And in the enemy scene, I just have another basic enemy. The tank just follows the player with this very simple script. I assume you have an enemy timer, and that's how you're spawning. So at the end of this enemy timer, we want to make a random number generator. This random number generator is like a generator making random numbers. It's pretty simple. Then we're going to randomize this so it changes the speed, you could say. Then you want to go into our player, go into the path 2D node, go into the path follow 2D node, then go into the offset, which we can see here, changing the offset to a random position on the path 2D follow node. Then we're going to create an instance of the enemy. If you zoom in, you can see the position 2D node right here. And we're just going to set the global position of our enemy to that position 2D node. Then we want to add the child to the scene. And if we play this here, we can move around. The enemy follows us. And it spawns from random directions without being in the camera. So anyways guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe, comment, like, and please, if you have any more tutorial ideas, Please comment it down below. Thank you for watching and goodbye.